He's got my superhero as his uh, cover. I love, I love, I love Black Titan. Oh my God, I learned so much about vertical integration. Uh, uh, ridiculous, that's great book, great book, great man. So if y'all have not, if y'all don't notice, I did a whole book review on Black Titan on my YouTube channel. Go check it out. It's about the story of A.G. Gastons, right? So one of the reasons I love to do book reviews, especially about black entrepreneurs and black thinkers, because we didn't see a lot of this when I was growing up. And I had no idea who A.G. Gastons was. And so I got mid-30-ish, right? And so I started doing content stuff. He should have been a household name. Household. Household. Black man. Jim Crow era. Became a multi, multi, multi billionaire. Not one, two, three, or four billions. Or excuse me, millions. I believe he was a hundred million strong when he wound up passing in the eighties. Yep. Billion so, billion of today's dollars. Yeah, it's the vertical yeah. integration. Started selling yep. insurance, then to realize, hey, I could own the funeral homes, I could have yep. the cemeteries, vertically integrated business ahead of his time and a time that they told us we couldn't do these things. And super duper fun fact, he also built Dr. Martin Luther King out of jail on segregation because this black man was from Birmingham, Alabama. Birmingham entrepreneur and businessman A.G. Gaston was one of the most successful African-American business owners in Alabama. Gaston overcame humble beginnings and racial discrimination to build a $40 million business empire. Gaston worked behind the scenes to financially support the civil rights movement, created an employee stock option, and sold his insurance company to his employees for a fraction of its value. 